Thank you for installing Evercom powered by Gabriel Secure Communication Suite. In this video, we're going to be going into a little bit more details as to what the chat features can do for you. I already have my Gabriel Suite open here on the chat window. And I just want to point out several things to you that you can use. Uh, the first thing that you may notice that for a chat feature, there are a lot of phones in a lot of places. This is so that way you can do a secure call with somebody. If your computer is outfitted with a microphone and a speaker, you can do a PC to PC call or possibly a PC to phone or phone to PC, depending on everybody's setup. Highly utilized in the mobile version of the app. And to just initiate that, you can just hit the phone button next to somebody's name, hit the phone icon above your chat window, or you can go over above your contacts and just click the start call to pick who you're going to start the call with. Moving on, the next to that start call button is a new message option, which is the basic way to start a new message if you want to send a new. Next to that, on the right of the start call is your manage friends button, which gives you the option to invite others to join you on Gabriel. Search the Gabriel directory for somebody you are not yet connected with. Allows you to create and manage your groups to organize your friends. And then you can see your pending friend requests and your friends list. Going back out of this, back to the main window, above your conversation, as mentioned in one of our other videos, that is on the right side here, next to that phone message that we mentioned earlier, there is a share screen option, which allows you to share screen with whoever you are speaking to in this chat. Simply click this button and it will guide you through sharing your screen with them. There is a little paperclip, which as we all know is the universal symbol for attaching or sharing a file. Doing this is very simple. Just click that and then choose a file or drag and drop a file onto it, just like any other email attachment. The final three dots on the right here gives you the advanced options for the conversation. So you can silence people if you wish to not be disturbed. You can hit more options and you can assign an alias to this person if you know them by a different name. You can change that on your end. Or you can remove friends this way as well with the delete friend button here. Backing out of this, the final feature I can show you for this is the on the record, off the record. Now this is an option that may or may not be enabled on your domain. That is the administrator in the point of contacts choice. If it is enabled for you to be able to do this yourself, you simply click the button down here next to the send paper airplane. Click it, it will ask to go off the record. Simply click go off the record and now your conversation is off the record. And as a reminder, the little save button down here now has an X on it. To go back on the record, simply click it and then click go on the record again. And now your conversations are being stored again. And this concludes our deep dive into the chat features. Be on the lookout for our other videos detailing the other features of Gabriel Secure Communications Suite. Thank you for choosing Asgard.